That is so awkward. I've been working on an album for the past couple months. Uh, it's called The Grand Mirage. Uh, the reason I named it that was I've been drawn to this idea of mirages and these physical phenomena that are basically illusions to us uh, and they appear to us during our most desperate times. And uh, I thought there were a lot of correlations between that situation and the way we have a relationship with our own inner voice, the way we perceive our surrounding reality. Our minds are constantly changing shape and adjusting to the experiences and the people we meet. Just everything in our day to day affects our minds sometimes and usually without us even realizing it. So because of this, I've asked myself constantly, how do we control our minds to live healthily with it when we ultimately don't have any control over it? So what I've come to realize is that the only way to have a free mind and live peacefully with it, at least my mind, is to acknowledge that there are things constantly affecting it, either for good or for the bad. And uh, that recognition alone is enough to affirm my existence, my, my presentness. And I think that for me gives me enough certainty <laughs> and coincidentally gives me a lot of purpose to life, which is, uh, but um, of course that's relevant to my life and my experiences, but I'm curious and I'd like to open up a question to you guys and let your perspectives inspire the final creative process while I finish this album. What has helped you live with a free mind, live presently and acknowledge that these illusions of your mind may exist? Send me your responses. Um, you can send me a video through text, email, or on my website. Massively appreciated.